Hello everybody, my name is Imperia and welcome back to Call of Cthulhu. Where we left off, we're still trying to get inside this fucking warehouse. Uh, apparently I have to consult my diary. So what have I missed? I... Oh, this ain't good. Didn't I do this last time? Validate. Ah, I don't think it saved last time. One moment. Oh, dear God. Yep, okay. I have to do this all again. That's weird. All right. I have caught up with where I was last episode. Turns out I didn't press save. Uh, and now, as I was roaming about, I found this door, which has a glow on it. Hmm. We're going to investigate. I hope it's nothing shouting at me. Ooh. What kind of ring am I wearing? I'm a square golden ring. Damnation. Broke it. God damn it. Nothing ever works out for me. It's no use. The padlock won't give. Right. Back to the mysteries. Can I climb this thing yet? No. Ah, <laughs> oh, this series is going to kill me. So I... From what I'm working out in a conversation dialogue, is that I can only ask specific questions because they're like, I don't want to keep asking the questions now. Which, fair, aren't they the two drunks from over there? I haven't spoken to you two fellas. Can I use your lantern? Hello. We're no longer at home on our own island. Calm down. It's not worth the effort. I told him, that flunky, that he'll see what a real sailor has in his belly. If what you did they have? Like that, everyone will see what you've got in your belly. I hope tunnel. so. I hope they don't forget the lesson. Me? I'm not scared of some girl. Uh, okay. I mean they're going to cut you open, you idiot. Calm down. <sighs> I agree. How about I see the old man? Can you help me out, please? I am in a pickle. You're back again. I am. What can I do for you? Um, uh, where's the Can you tell me where? Look, I've already shown it to you. It's the one with the cop on guard duty out front. Okay. You can't miss it. Understood. I shall be on my way. So come. All right. There's got to be something further I need to be doing at the front. So it's got to be on this side. I think that area for me, just building that winch. I think that's just for fun, or for something much later. We'll find out. Proved I really know cat. She uses a stiletto. It's risky to question my word. I wouldn't like you to get cut with a certain Italian knife. Okay, okay. You've convinced us. I convinced and them. Sent you. What do you want from us? I, I want you to, to take leave. a look inside the Hawkins warehouse. Leave me alone, and I'll put in a good word for you with Cat. Um, okay, it's a deal. Dealio. Did I do it? I finally did it. And all it took was me having to replay it again. Oh, yeah. Sweet, sweet progression. Inside the warehouse I go for reasons I've forgotten about. So I need to climb this ladder. But what is this? What am I looking at? I'm pulling. Okay, I opened a little area which has burn marks. Let's add more! Ah, there is a green glow from that warehouse. Alright, I guess it's this way. Let's see. Let's see, I'm seeing. Come on, Pierce, do me proud. The first one was just a fluke. Shoot. You I'll fucking suck, Pierce. Well, well. Oh, hello. Little mouse has got lost on our turf. You're not only inquisitive, you're also stupid. Nice and to meet you. I gave you the crazy idea to come onto my turf. I am a private investigator. Um, don't say anything. Yeah. <laughs> you Has first. Your tongue? You've come for a fight. What I've got to say won't change a thing. You're a quick learner. I decide who comes in and who stays out. And anyone who doesn't respect my rules, I punish them. 
You're very, um... Oh, I could just meet a tech. So Is you're your a cat. cat. What of it? Maybe we can come to an understanding. Maybe. An understanding. Or maybe not. Ah! Good, deflect. Wait, am I, am I winning? Uh, I, I think I'm losing. I got need in the nuts. This is not a fun day Get for me. Get this joker out of here. He might have a little trouble walking on his own. Okay. I got beat the shit out of. Oh, I'm getting careless. I didn't see that coming. If I want to get into this warehouse, I'm going to have to deal with her. Okay, so... Can I make a deal with her? Am I limping? Where did I get moved to? I, he put me behind the drunks. Okay, back to the front. Let's see if I can lie again. Hi, me again, fellas. So about that business. Man! This game is hard! Officer, I would like to report a crime. No need. Oh, no one wants to talk to me! Can I talk to Cat in the pub? Or if I just keep coming back? What? Another break? Hello. Hey, Mitchell, a drink for our new friend. Yes, we're friends you. now. You don't know how to fight, but at least you've got guts. Yeah, aching guts. Oof, huh. oof, ouch, my guts. I've got them too. But you don't hear me whining like a pooch who's lost its leash. You didn't back down. It's something that I respect. <sighs> mm. So understand by that. If I catch you again, you'll carry a more permanent reminder of our encounter. Can tell we become me. best friends? Easy to dark water. Uh, tell the truth. I'm investigating the deaths of the Hawkins family. It's very nice of you to tell me the truth so openly. But it's also really stupid of you. You really don't seem to know the area. Let mm. me give you a little advice. If you want to survive more than a day in this rat hole, avoid talking about them to the first people you meet. What do I know who? Um... I need help getting into the warehouse. I need to get into the Hawkins warehouse. You're out of luck. It's on my turf. It's precisely for that reason that I've come to see you. Are you pulling my leg? Um... Would I have taken that risk? I've seen what you're capable of. And you didn't miss me. I accept the compliment. Well, I see you're serious. Yes. To be honest, as long as it doesn't interfere with my business, I don't care. What is but your I'll business? Go with you to make sure you don't stick your nose into things that don't concern you. Um, Sounds honest to me. Sure, that's I'm okay. I'm not finished. Oh. If I do that for you, if I let you onto our turf to conduct your little affairs, You'll be indebted to me, and I guarantee that I always collect on what I'm owed. Think about it. I help you, you'll owe me a favor in return. Hmm. Do you accept? Gracious offer. No. I don't think I'm ready to pay the price. As you wish. But I think you'll be back. Alright, I'm gonna go see if I can find a fucking winch. <laughs> I'm back! Hey. Mitchell, I owe you. Yeah. Huh. You didn't so under tell me. Uh, what happens if I lie to someone? Fascinated. Huh. You reek of private eye. The Hawkins. Oh. Now why doesn't that surprise? If you want to survive more than a day. Um. I need to get in. You're out of luck. Are you pulled? What I did. I've seen. And you. I accept. Well, to be honest, but I'll go. Sounds off. I'm not. If I do, you'll be in, and I get. Think about. Yes, do I'll I take your debt. Oh, we always have one, detective. Follow me. Nobody uh, questions your authority here. I was given to believe that Fitzroy stood up to you. That dope tried to save face in front of his sailors. They revere their brave captain as they do their old statues. But sooner or later, all statues get buried in bird shit. Get to Nobody the point, cares. Kat! And the police? They do nothing to stop you? The local cops? The cops drink like everyone else, sweetheart. They know where their interests lie. Apart from that pig-headed Bradley. Bradley. I don't know whether to admire his stubbornness or to have pity on him. He's gonna get us into trouble. You can't understand. You're not safe. What if I run ahead? 
Uh, thanks for parting ways. That's really good. Thanks, fellas. Thank you. We saw this guy poking around here. Yeah, best friends. Okay. 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 Right. Climb up here. Avoid her. Oh, I guess I can't. Let me in, Cap. I'm going to have to just sit here and wait. While that happens, I'm going to have a biscuit. Oh, we got her. That's how it's done. Do Thank I you. Need to hold your hand, or do you think you'll get by on your own now? Don't I'm holding my hand. It. Good. In that case, I'll leave you. I've done enough mothering for now. Well, right, mom. Oh, this place stinks. I did it. All on what my is the own. Between this place and the Sarah Hawkins case. Let's increase my something. Ah, oh, I've got them all even. And if picking locks fucking give me that crap. <laughs> Right. Ah. Uh, a reconstruction zone. Mine eyes. Okay. Medicine. Who has enough money to buy painkillers but stays in a place like this? That is interesting. Ooh. It delicious. smells as bad as it looks. Some yumsies, okay. A painting, which I think is going to be very important. So, what's around here? A clue! A deep Parisian. Who might the keep small... a news clipping about Sarah Hawkins? The small partisan? A mirror brain! The glass is shattered, like someone smashed it. Was it before or after the removal of these bandages? Big punch. Okay, um, these rags, whatever this is on the floor. Oh, more psychology. What is this picture of Charles and Sarah Hawkins doing here? Ah, oh, curling up, sleeping. All right, what's this, ma'am? Is this one of Sarah Hawkins' paintings? Damn good painting, though. All right, I'm leaving now. Hopefully Cat finds me just there going, oh. A. Oh, two. All right, let's get this up. I did it. <laughs> ah. Jesus, that big sneeze. Alright. Is there anything more? How about a thing to open up that winch? Can't open this door. Alright, I guess I gotta find out now what cat wants in return. In here. Oh shit. And whoever it is. Has something to tell me about the Hawkins case. Is there anyone in there? You! Don't move! Oh, hello! Detective Pierce. I told you to stay away from this warehouse. I tried. Um. Let's team up! No. Do you not threaten him? You sent your men away. Bad idea. I see only one overweight police officer and one hardened veteran. How dare you! I am a representative of the law. <laughs> Relax. Look what I found. Can you explain what this painting is doing here? I like that. that. Strange <laughs> portrait. Wait, I know it. It was in the Hawkins mansion when we came to investigate the fire. So you confirm that it was removed from the crime scene. Interesting. Interesting. I'd like to go and see the mansion now. Of course. You want to go back along his trail? <sighs> I'd like to understand how this painting made it to here. Come on. My car is parked down the way. Ah, oh, best friends. All I had to do was threaten him. Would you please shut the door? And open your eyes, damn it. This guy went right under your nose. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, damn it. Her again. Hi, cat. This case has nothing to do with you, Baker. Clear the passage or I'll shut you up for obstruction. Officer Bradley, 
You've finally grown a pair. Too bad you're too fat to see them down there. Why does everyone call him fat? You? Come on, keep the smile. You don't want to force me to widen it. Okay, I get it. Can we go to the mansion now? Poor Officer Bradley. I straightened you out, mister. I am disappointed, but we'll meet again. Is it far, this mansion? Hey, that's me. Look at my sick Look coat. Behind you, at the top of the ridge. Oh. You see the building? That's the Hawkins Mansion. Come on, we got some driving to do. That is a fucking awesome place to put a mansion. Yes! <laughs> that took so long. Entering the madness, driving up to the mansion. Cool old timey car. Very silent. Nice gates. A jacket though, my god. Why do I have a big scar on my head? And Braddy's got a big Chelsea scar. What happened to all of us? I hear breathing. Oh. Was I the thing in the night? Well, here we are, Hawkins Mansion. Eh. Uh. Your hair is too brushed. The place has been abandoned since the fire. Mm hmm. There's only old Winchester in his hut. And, oh, maybe that was then, that guy. Uh, okay. I thought the mansion burnt in the no fire. scorched trees or fire damage on the building. You're pretty damn observant, ain't you? Aha. Uh -huh. The fire was quickly contained. Old Silas acted as soon as he could. Good old Not Silas. enough to save the Hawkins. Okay, You're that was trapped me. trapped in the drawing room. And don't go troubling Silas anymore. His guilt torments him enough as it is. Are we going to take a closer look at this mansion, or do you have other questions? I have several, according to this menu. Um, I know the place You're very the well. You're who looked after the Hawkins case. Don't think I was trying to hide it. It's just that this discovery shakes my convictions. That's why you're so keen to find out who removed the painting from the mansion. Yes. If something escaped us, or if there's been a law enforcement error, then it's up to the police to make good its mistake. Anything else? Uh, yes, uh, four more things, I think. You place is falling into ruin. that it looked any better three months ago. It's a very old building, you know? Mm-hmm. Its it foundations it. would probably date from the arrival of the first settlers. Huh. It's really that old. Come on, let's leave the stories of the dead alone. It's nothing to do with your case, anyhow. Let's go up there. <laughs> Unless you still have questions. I have three more, thank you. Oh, two more, I guess. Uh, anything I, I should be aware of. Prepared if there's going to be trouble. It's a wise attitude. But apart from old Silas and some rotten floorboards, there's nothing to worry about. You're talking about Winchester. That's <laughs> right. The Hawkins old caretaker. Good old Strictly Silas, speaking, maybe. He ain't dangerous. But since the tragedy, he's been a little touched. Though By he's fire? a remarkably sturdy man, given his age. A true force of nature. Interesting. That old man doesn't worry me. Hey, See, you might you be guilt-ridden. Listen to my advice. We might as well go, right? Oh, do you have any more? Uh, you're the first to talk Your about partner, Winchester. Partner Andrews warned me against him. You managed to get something out of that bomb. I'll end up asking you for advice. Hey, he talks too much. He inferred that old Silas was slightly unhinged. That's not far off the mark, I suppose. Mm -hmm. But kind of unfair at the same time. You've you know, just been mean to him the whole time. Silas Winchester has been working for the Hawkins family as far back as I can remember. Charles was like a son to him. The day of the fire, he lost his whole family. So he's got nowhere to go. And, as you'll see, in a way he's still watching over them. Is there anything else I you see. want to ask me? Or do you want to go up there? Let's not waste time not anymore, I guess. Quickly here. And I want to be able to see when we arrive. I'll go with you, if only to reassure Silas. That's very helpful of you. Yes. Why not? You can help. Right. Let's go. 
Ah, the game is safe. Fantastic. Great to know. Right, we'll follow the officer in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please do tell me. Thank you all so much for watching. Bye-bye.